there's a lot of motherfucking things that's been going on recently. A lot of images flashing all around me. Pretty and pink, twee and petite. And it's been happening ever since I... Well, I stopped being my high motherfucking self. I've been off of them for about five fucking weeks now. NOT LONG ENOUGH! And it's made me see things clearer than I ever motherfucking did before. LIKE WATER FLOWING DOWN A RIVER! I SEE IT ALL! I saw motherfucker himself hasty being his usual motherfucking self and attacking somebody I like. Big bad teddy bear trying to be a grizzly bear! Ooh wee! All I have to say is Why do you feel why do you feel so motherfucking disrespected? Why do you feel like nobody respects you? Here's a better question! Why do you give a fuck? You got it all! We're given a distinct crash course in the motherfucking realities of this world and the cosmos that align around us. And now you are at the peak of what you should have been a couple of motherfucking years ago. Zahara Morgan can now say that you weren't broke goods! You're the VW motherfucking champion. You did what any other motherfucker did, and quite frankly, Say, hey, I'm not mad at the fact that you did things the way you did because I don't follow that atrocious one-dimensional idea that people call honor. Especially not when it's involving the wrestling business! <clears throat> now that's the greatest joke in the world. MOTHERFUCKING PUNCHLINE! But since you attacked my friend... You attacked a man that helped train me after the match because you got all caught up in your feelings like a <laughs> like a auntie on Thanksgiving. Your mashed potatoes were soggy, auntie! I don't give a fuck! You decide to take your, yo, motherfucking aggressions out on TJ. Was it because you was hearing those motherfucking commentators up there saying that he was out wrestling you, out doing you in every way, shape, or form, and by the grace of God and bad luck and a fucked up knee, you now stand still VW motherfucking champion. Again, I say... Why do you fucking care? You holding the gold, and all they do is holding they nuts! So all I'm asking you is this, Steel. You call yourself a threat, but I don't feel threatened. You say you're the Prince of Death, but have you really walked motherfucking death before? Cause last I checked, death ain't a manga you're reading, or the last cheeseburger you ate fatty! But maybe, I should put that to the test. Maybe, I should, uh, see if you really are a threat. Cause see, I've had motherfucking threats all my life, and, uh, I don't run from the threat. I stare 
the motherfucking threat in his eyes. And I make out with this shit as I shake him in the goddamn throat. So, Mr. Prince of Death, how about you stare into my motherfucking eyes and we dance that same old dance that you seem to be very known for ever since your little embrace of the darkness that have made you who you motherfucking are right now. But since you probably forgot, let me tell you who I motherfucking am. I am Stephen Zane, and my mind has been cleared. At long last, I have now found my motherfucking understanding. I have finally found and got my motherfucking understand on as to who I am. Who truly is the merciful messiahs of this goddamn plane of existence? It. Me. And also motherfucking me. And now. And motherfucking now. I stare. At the first of many wicked pictures I paint with their blood. From your veins will drip my miracles, and your crushed bones will become my special stardust as I put it through the sky. Clown, y'all have called me. And a clown, I will be so welcome to the Dark Carnival, brother! Hulk. Hulk. Hulk.